Oh no, that's sorry, that's Raiden. Sorry, Raiden. I didn't I didn't have my reading glasses on, so I apologize. And Gia. Okay, and alright, so are you guys ready? Please put your um, and who do we have on Facebook Live? Oh, we've got Ellis. Hi Ellis, good to see you. Alright, you guys, so do place your water bottle somewhere off to the side so that when you need it, you can have some water. Please make sure again, like always, take a look around you. Is your space where you're going to work safe that you're not going to end up like hitting something? Alright, let's kneel down. So toes touching in the back, fists on our thighs. Let's face shins and hand down. Us. AJ, please bow the class in. Us, my son. Us, eyes closed, everyone. Hold it. And come on back. Whew. 
Putting the bottom of our feet together, let's rock on our sokuto. Ichi, ni, san, shi, go, ruku, shichi, hachi, ku, ju. Press your elbows on, <laughs> press your knees to the floor. You can use your hands or your elbows to see how low you can get. Some of you just can put your knees on the floor easy peasy, right? Some of you need help, like Jun Chan Rock needs to push your knees. Give it a shake. Let's stand up in the Kibidachi. Nice strong Kibidachi. Stretch it out. Very good. Hands behind your head. Let's walk our feet in. Ready? Ichi. Toes all the way in. Knee. Heels in. Sun. Chi. Go. Roku. Shichi. Hachi. Ku. Toes are touching. Ju. Heels are touching. Reach up. Oh, stretch as high as you can. Clap. Palm heels to the ground. Ichi. Ni. San. Shi. Go. Ruk. Shichi. Hachi. Ku. Ju. Grab your ankles, bring your head to your knees. Bend those knees and slowly stand up. Very good. Let's all pull our right foot in. Nare. Let's face shins and, and bow. Pus. And please face here and bow. Pus. Ready? We're going to start out warming up nice and easy with jumping jacks. So make sure you have space. You, have, you can do jumping jacks. You can do jumping jacks. You choose which way. But are you ready? Get set and begin. I'm going to go get the stopwatch.
Keep your other knee up as high as your belt. So Charlie and Gracie, get that knee out front up as high as your belt. Get that knee up, get that knee up, Gracie. Higher, Gracie. We have 12 more seconds on this leg. Keep going. Oh my goodness, I lost my balance. I was watching Gracie's knee drop and I lost my balance. Shame on me. Stop. Okay, guess what? Now we have to do with the other leg. Oh no. Pick your other leg up. Here we go. Keep good balance. Keep that knee up. Tighten your core. I find if I keep my hands up, I have better balance. And funny, my knee stays up better. We have 15 more seconds. We're bending that back leg as deep as we can. 10 seconds. Come on, we can do this. Keep that knee up. Keep that knee up. Don't stop. Five, four, three, two, one. Woo! Boy, that was a challenge. Did anyone else feel like it was a challenge? I definitely did. All right. We're not done warming up though. Okay. Put your feet shoulder width apart. I'm going to turn sideways to demonstrate because you're going to push your tushy out and come back. Okay. We're going to do squats. Ready, set, go. Now, see how I try to keep my back straight? In fact, I try to keep my eyes up on the ceiling up above me. That keeps my back straight, so I'm not doing this. That's a bad, bad way for our knees. And so keep your back straight, keep your eyes up. And in 40 seconds, we'll be done. So keep going. We have 30 seconds left. Now if you can, tighten your butt, your butt muscles when you stand up. So pinch those butt muscles together as you stand up. We have 15 seconds left. Five seconds. And stop. Fantastic. You know, it's time for push-ups. So, you remember you have three push-up choices. You can be on your knees, but if you're on your knees, you're working on keeping your elbows really close to each other, no elbows sticking out. You can be on your toes, but you're still working on having good form elbows in. Or you can do Spider-Man, the only one where your hands are out, your elbows are out. As you lower yourself into a push-up position, you bring your knee up to touch, and then push yourself back up. You choose. Gia, your belt I think is exploding. So let's get ready to go. We're gonna do one minute of push-ups. I like to choose on my knees because I really want to keep my elbows close to my body and really feel my back of my arms get tired. Ready, set, begin. Try to keep those elbows in tight. Try not to have butts in the air. Now I know that's kind of weird if you're on your hands and your knees, but you can make your body more slanty. Thirty seconds left. Woo, my backs of my arms are getting tired. We have twenty seconds left. Don't forget to breathe. This is where you might explode. And then we have to clean up the kid parts all off the ceiling. That's not cool. Keep going. Five, four, three, two, one. And stop. Fantastic. Okay, roll over on your backs. So we're going to pretend we're out swimming. So you can put your hands underneath your lower back or behind your head. But what's going to happen is we're going to kick our legs up for five then crisscross for five. Then kick our legs up and down for five, and then crisscross for five. Are you ready? Get set, and begin. So five up and down, then crisscross, then up and down again, and you guys know the rest of the story. Now Charlie, make those legs longer, man. Those of you who are just flipping your legs like this, that's cheating. Keep your long legs long. 
No bending your knees. Keep going. And we have 30 seconds left. Gia, I like how you're keeping your legs nice and long. I can see Aaron's toes. I can see Charlie and Gracie's knees. You guys, are you bending your knees? Keep going. Gia, was that Louie? There's Louie running around like a little crazy puppy. We have five seconds left. Keep going. Keep going. And stop. All right. Fantastic. Roll over onto your left side. What we're going to do is we're going to bring our leg up in chamber. And all we're going to do is roundhouse kick for a full minute. Keep that leg up in chamber. Ready, set, begin. So I'm going to look like Gia, like I'm sitting here just kind of hanging out. You know, like maybe talking on the phone, like, hi Gia, how was your day today? Did you do anything fun? Is that a thumbs up or a nah? Keep your chamber though. Keep your chamber. If you do this right, the muscles in your rear end are going to start talking to you and they're going to say something like, hey, I'm tired. Now, everyone, I should be able to see your leg kicking up into the screen. Into the screen. So if I can't see you, I should see your feet somewhere in that screen. There, AJ, I saw your toes. Okay, Raiden, I got your leg. Fantastic. We have 18 seconds left on this leg. Woo, I feel it. You ever hear the saying, it says, feel the burn? Well, before it was for a political reason, it was feeling the burn of your muscles exercising. Two, one, stop. Woo, okay, guess what? You know we have two sides, so we have to have two sides for this. Are you ready? I still want to see your legs come up and around. Set, go. Let me see that roundhouse kick. I want to see your foot in the screen if I can't see all of you. Nice and strong. Keep working. Do you want the good news or the bad news? The good news is 22 seconds have gone by. The better news is we have 30 seconds left. The bad news is we only have 30 seconds left. <laughs> 20 seconds left. Keep going. Keep working. Don't stop. 15 seconds left. Woo, I feel the burn. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Stop. Woo. All right, you guys, I want to show you how to stretch those muscles that you just exercised. Take your left leg, cross it over your right leg, and hug your knee to your chest. So I'll show you from the side here. You take your left leg, cross it over your right leg, and hug your knee to your chest. You should feel your butt muscle being stretched a little bit. If that doesn't feel like you're stretching very much, you can lean back and pull your knee to your chest. Either one can work, especially if you've just worked your butt muscles a little bit. Now change legs, stretch the other side. Wonderful, fantastic. So if you happen to have a pillow cushion from the couch or a stuffed animal that you don't mind getting dropped or or a uh, pillow you sleep with, please grab it because we're going to do what's called rock drops now. All right. Double check because because what's going to happen is we're going to kind of slam this thing to the ground. So make sure, AJ, you want to slam that, that cool guy to the ground. I'm going to get something. So I'm going to demonstrate what we're going to do and then we're all going to do it. So I'm going to hold the end. So I have handles here, but if you don't have any handles, you can grab, grab the end of your pillow like this. And what you're going to do is you're going to bring it above your head, and you're going to drop down, and then come back up. But if you notice, 
that when I drop down, I get my butt low. I don't just bend over, I don't just do this. No way. You gotta get your butt down. This is called rock drop. So we're gonna, so AJ, you ready to use your gorilla for your rock drops? As long as you're okay with it, I don't want you to be sad if it gets hurt. So make sure you bend your knees and get your tushy low. Ready, set, let's begin. So we're up high. Up high again. And if you do it well, it gets a nice noise. I think it's so happy. What's that? <laughs> and then my dog, Louis. You didn't hear Louis, did you? We have 30 seconds left. moving forward. I have, I have to get my feet up higher. Okay. Ten seconds. And stop. All right. You can put that on the side. We may use it again later. All right, you guys. So now it's time to do some punching and kicking. So here's what we're going to do in our fighting stance. We're going to do front snap kick. Punch, punch, Roundhouse kick. And you're just gonna keep doing it. Kick, punch, punch, roundhouse kick. Kick, punch, punch, roundhouse kick. You can change your feet at any time, but it's a front snap kick, two punches, and a roundhouse kick. Ready, set, begin. Keep your hands up though, you guys. And stop. Fantastic. Okay. So I'm going to bring out the magic samurai sword. Alright. So here's what's going to happen. You're going to have to fight. I'm going to high, low, 
middle. You're gonna duck, jump, get out of the way, and just keep going. Are you guys ready? Hands up in a fighting stance, because I may change directions every once in a while. Here we go. So we're going to start with Charlie. Charlie's going to list five of his favorite things. Then Gracie. Then Aaron. Then Raiden. Then Gia. Then AJ. Ellis, you have to type your five favorite things in the comments so I can list them out for everyone. So you're going to hold that plank. So everyone unmute yourselves. So this one doesn't have the time. We could be done in 20 seconds, we could be done in two hours, depending on how long it takes everyone to list their five eight favorite things. Are you ready? So get ready, we're gonna hold our plank. You can be either on your hands and toes, or your knees and toes. But remember to hold your stomach muscles in, and speak loudly so everyone can hear your five eight favorite things. Charlie, remember, you're first. Everyone ready? Down into your push-up position. Get set, and push up. Charlie, what is five of your favorite things? My mom, my dad, my sister, Hazel, and Brandon. Wonderful. Go, Gracie. Uh, my mom, my dad, my sister, Hazel, and Brandon. Wonderful. Go, Erin. Uh, my brother, my dad, my two dogs, the color blue, and food. All right, Raiden. I mean, Raiden. Ice cream, books, my house, my mom, my dad, and friends. Wonderful. Gia! Uh, 
My family, Cove Wood, books, my house and nature, awesome. And orange, green, purple, red, blue, fantastic. Ellis, thank you for being on the ball, my man. Everyone stand up. We are not done. Per the clock, we have how many minutes left? Oh, six minutes. We got six minutes, you guys. So we're going to go for three more minutes. Are you ready? So here we go. We're going to be in a fighting stance, and we're going to do a front kick, Back kick, front kick, back kick. Ready? Look over your shoulder, make sure you don't kick the cat, the furniture, or a loved one. Get set, go. <laughs> Charlie, yep, yeah, make sure you're kicking with front kick with left leg and back kick with the right leg. Hey, guess what, AJ? Good news. We have 45 seconds left. The bad news is only 22 seconds have gone by. Oh, okay. 30 seconds left. Kibidachi. Okay, so now I want you to pretend there's a big speed bag in front of you and you're going to punch it. Remember your hands circle and you're going to punch it as fast as you can. Don't get so excited you punch yourself in the face. It hurts. How do I know? I've done it. Are you guys ready? Get set. Give me a big Kibidachi. Go. This is it. This is the finale. We're going to be tired hopefully when we're done. Get lower Gracie and Charlie. You are my senior students. You should have deepest horse stunts. Keep going. Oh, Aaron, I like it. Yes. Oh, Raiden, I can tell yours is deep, man. I can only see your neck. Keep going. Keep going. Yeah. Oh, I love it, Raiden. That's an awesome horse stance. Wonderful. <laughs> Charlie or Gracie, that is so cute that your cat is playing with your belt. <sighs> That's funny. Keep going. That's what I love about kittens. They think everything is a toy. 20 seconds left. Here we go, keep going, go faster with those hands. Keep going. Don't punch yourself in the face. Keep going. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Yummy. Now stay in your horse stance. No, stay in your horse stance. Hands together, gasho. Nice and low. Nice and gasho. Get nice and low. Your legs should be burning. Very good. Now put your arms out in front of you. Take a big breath in. And exhale. Again, arms straight out. Breathe in. And exhale. One more time. Arms straight out. Breathe in. And exhale. Right leg's going to move in. All right. Very good. Let's 